Hey girls, it's Clancy, and today I'm going to be showing you how I personally get my hair to look healthy, straight, smooth, sleek, and most of all, I don't know what the most of all is, but how um, shiny, what? Pretty much this is what I do on a daily basis for when I want straight hair. Obviously I don't straighten my hair every day, most of, most of the times if we're going to be honest, it's on top of my head in a bun because that's just the way I like it. It's easiest. <laughs> but yeah, so pretty much if you want to see how to get your hair looking like this, then keep watching. This is um all natural glam and gloss. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to quickly brush through my hair quickly. Then I'm going to blow dry it. Now let me tell you something. Before about two weeks ago, I never used a blow dryer. Ever. Like literally, I think once in my life. Like maybe twice. I don't even know. But I never did. Then I was contacted by FlatironExperts.com to try out this blow dryer. It is the QT, like the letter Q and then T, not QT, QT Performance Hair Styling Blow Dryer. And I decided to get a blow dryer because I knew I would need one in college. Like, I just know I'm going to be rushing. I can't afford to, have, like, I don't have the luxury that I do here, you know what I mean? So I was like, oh, you're going to need it. You're going to need to learn. Oh, it's going to suck. I am in love with the product that it gives me. I really don't think this is just every blow dryer because the ones that I've used... I've only used two in my entire life, I'd say, and I've only used them like once each. It just made my hair like so unbelievably frizzy. Now let me tell you something. When I use this blow dryer, I'm not going like each and every piece perfectly. I straighten my hair after this. I'm just doing this to get it dry, but at least it's not making my hair a huge afro. And I guess you'll kind of just see for yourself what I do. And then I guess you'll see my blow drying technique. It's not a technique at all. You're going to be like, what is she doing? But this is just what I learned to do in the past couple weeks, and I really do like it, so... And I put this on the hottest heat setting and the, well, strongest, you know, strongest setting, I guess you could say. Power setting, I don't know. And normally, I've gone to Turks and Caicos, that's where I was. Um, that, this was my fourth time. Every other time, you have never seen me with straight hair there. I just can't straighten my hair because I can't blow dry because it'll make it frizzy, right? I have my hair straight every single night because that's how much of a non-hassle it was. It was just amazing, okay? <laughs> but yeah, so let's get started. That was supposed to be like on perfect timing, but it wasn't. Electro disco. Electro disco. You don't really know how I. You don't really know how I. You don't really know how I do this now. So right now it has been like, honest to God, I would say six minutes of blow drying and my hair is basically dry. What I like to do is I like to put it on the cold setting, blast it, and blow dry my hair for about like two more minutes. Just because cold temperature tends to make your hair shiny. Now this is the time where I put on my makeup, so that's exactly what I'm going to do. Okay, so I just finished doing my makeup and... Basically, my hair is 5,000% dry. So now I'm going to be taking the same heat protectant, kind of just spritz. If it would just spritz, come on. I know you got it in you. There we go. Spritz it. All my hair. Brush it all out. And then I'm going to separate my hair in half and clip off this first half. And I'm literally just going to straighten this entire half. Oh, and the straightener I use is the, whoa, KQC Professional Ceramic Heat um, Iron. This is just what I've been using for over a year. Obsessed with it. I'm just going to straighten my entire head. My entire head. I mean, my entire head of hair. So now that all of my hair is straightened, I'm going to be taking this bed head after party serum cream thing. Yeah, and put it all over my hair. What I do is I take each half of my hair and I do a little bit on each half, like this much. And lightly 
put it throughout my hair. Focusing on below the ear. Putting like the same amount, rub it in. Then I'm going to take my brush and kind of just lightly brush through it. Did you hear that knot? Because I sure did. No, it's all good. And now my hair looks silky, healthy, shiny, and most of all, straight. I'll show you. It goes down to here. Some nights I leave it like this, and I kind of just want to have like, kind of like that Japanese look. Or other times I will brush it all back. Kind of wear it like this. Which I guess I kind of do prefer this look. It's more like rustic. I don't even know. But yeah, so pretty much that's everything that I do. And I hope you guys enjoyed, and comment below what your everyday hair routine is to get silky, straight, smooth, healthy, straight-looking hair. Bye. So this is, this is, ah, oh, this is not cool. Because, whoa.